St. Nick here. It's almost that time of year again, and I've just finished checking if your children, grandchildren, younger siblings, nieces, or nephews are on the nice list. Spoiler alert! They are! They always are. Some people say I'm too soft, but it's Christmas! Ho, ho, ho! As a wise man, but not one of the wise men once said, the kids are all right. <laughs> yes. No, it's you, the adults I wanted to check in on. See what you've learned now that you've had more than a few Christmases behind you. And the fear of getting a lump of coal from old Sandy doesn't keep you awake at night anymore. Hmm. I've had my elves keep a record of all your achievements over the last year. Hmm. Let me see. <laughs> oh, I see you've been breaking records. Congratulations. Oh, oh, oh. Four. July 2023 being the hottest month on Earth ever recorded in human history? That doesn't sound good. The sea around Florida reached 38 degrees Celsius in June. Brazil had a heat wave in winter, with some areas reaching 41.8 degrees. What are you doing? Here's a hint, eh? When you start to hear terms in the news like climate emergency, polar vortex, bomb cyclones, and mega fires, maybe take it seriously. If the North Pole gets any warmer, I'll have to shave the polar bears to stop them getting heat stroke. Right, well, what else is in here? Uh, here's a section titled Ongoing Conflicts. Always fun, hmm. The Russian invasion of the Ukraine. Is this still going on? That's been going on for something like 650 days. Are you all just sitting there watching it happen? Have you forgotten about it? 2023 Israel Hamas war. Not another one. Many people have voiced their opposition to the war by posting Instagram stories. I'm getting the migraine. Is there any positive news? Eurovision. Good. Coronation. Blair. New Beatles song. Eh, fine. And what's this? Barbenheimer, a celebrated major cultural event caused by the simultaneous release of two films. One about a plastic doll and the other about the feather of the atomic bomb. I, I've read enough. <clears throat> so, the threat of a lump of coal no longer scares you. Great. In that case, have it all. Burn it to your heart's content. I hope the brief burst of fossil fuel warmth comforts you when you're choking on smog, bailing out your flooded home for the third time in a year, struggling to breathe in 50 degree heat, watching food prices keep rising and rising because crops keep failing all over the world. Oh, but at least you don't have to give up your petrol car or bother with correctly separating your recycling. I see you. I knew that look. You don't take me seriously. I'm a fairy tale, a folk tradition corrupted by capitalism and Coca-Cola. Oh, what harm could I do to you, eh? I'm just a figment, existed only in your mind. Yes, but in your mind I do exist. Burrow deep in your consciousness since you were a child, and I'm still here. Did you think the naughty list disappears when you grow up? I see you when you're sleeping, remember? I know when you're awake, and I'm just as real as all your other thoughts. You might have left the carrot out for Rudolph, but now I have the stick. Try to dismiss me if you like, but I'm part of you. There's no getting rid of me now. You can pretend I'm not there, that I don't exist, but you'll know you're only pretending. Whenever you feel a wintry chill down your spine, that's me leaving you a lump of cold. So these are the gifts for you, my Christmas wishes, my season's greetings. May you forever feel uneasy, unsatisfied, incomplete. May your foundational beliefs be proved baseless. May your loved ones see through you. May your God be found dead. May your favorite coffee pods be discontinued. May your skin become blotched and wrinkled despite all of those expensive creams. May your jokes fall flat 
May your subscriptions get even more expensive. May all of your sexual encounters be disappointing and humiliating. May your hobbies lose their joy. May you be labeled a boomer in a viral meme. May your life become just a little more difficult and a lot more thankless. May you remain stiff and unfit despite all of your selfies in the gym. May you see your ex looking amazing. May your farts be unkeep inable. May your most beloved TV program be rebooted as a soulless shell of itself. May your smart speaker always understand you, except when you're showing it off to someone else. <laughs> May you find yourself contemplating going to an improv class. May you find yourself attracted to a politician. May you, one night, wake up to find me standing over your naked, bound body, tugging at your reins and shouting, Ride me, Rudolph! Ride me around the world! And once your mediocre, disappointing life finally ends, may you be eternally trapped in a room with Brendan O'Connell, raving about how he made Mrs. Brown's boy. He's also naked. Ho, ho, ho. Merry Christmas. <laughs> <laughs>